Natalia giving good vision here. They know that BTK is on this right hand bush. Kufra with the concuss concussive blast. Nice first kill. Already Ready first first blood. Wow. Blood coming in. Pressure in the front line. Kufra trying to. Oh, he, he actually has vision that the Shinobi is doing the Lord. This is going to be risky. It's going to be a 50 50 export. Actually, stealing this Lord with the ulti. Cardi making the place. And this is what I mean when I said all they need yeah. to um, Shinobi should have played smarter instead of doing a 50 50 Lord. Um, in my opinion, but it looks like Chu might get picked picked off here, getting bursted by Moba Zane. That's gonna be a pick off again for BTK. It looks like Xborg did an ulti to zone it out. Barrett is getting bullied right here by this Xborg, and this is not looking good. BT for a little bit for his teammates to actually survive and respawn, but it's gonna it's it's looking very slim right now. Xborg still has immortality, so he he has a lot of pressure. He's not scared to ulti in, and BTK turning the game around just like that. Wow. Um, just a little bit too impatient right there. Maybe he saw that Franco was too tanky, so he doesn't want to go for that pickup. Franco missing another hook, and it looks like there's going to be another brawl here on the top lane. Fox is getting a burst. Roger getting a killing spree. Mega kill coming in from Lapu Lapu. This is not looking good for Shinobi. Double kill coming in from Lapu Lapu and Roger. But oh my, I don't even think BTK needs the Lord to finish the game. And they're just waiting for minions to end here. And BTK right now, they're waiting for the Lord to spawn. Oh man, they're so confident that they're gonna take this game. That Marsa getting that solo kill. So they, they're gonna dive into the base. Lapu Lapu getting another kill on Kari. This is not looking good for Shinobi. And that might be it. Winter Truncheon going down for Alice, but it doesn't matter. BTK is way too strong. They snowball way too hard. And that is a victory. Rotation here from both teams. Um, you know, they haven't met yet. Nice one from Selena. What's gonna happen here? Nice bite, but it looks like the Selena might be in big trouble. First blood coming from Kari. This is unexpected so far because the early game is supposed to, supposed to go to Gosu. But so far, Brotherhood, we're keeping up with the early stage of the game right now. Baxia is in big trouble. He has to go over the lane. And Brotherhood, in order to counter this, in order for Alice to go online, they need to keep focusing this bot lane so that Alice can actually farm a little bit. But look at this. There's going to be a team by going on. Fuzz is going to ulti. And Kari's in big trouble. He is out of position. It's overextended. Selena's going to get a stun on the Alice. This is it. Selena finally making the first play, his first play of the game, high load, 4v1, not enough damage, and that is going to be a 0 for 3 trade OT, x does survive with 10% HP and Faraga armor, but look at, look at Toshi with all the pressure behind this first tier tower, alright, Selena hitting the stun on x and that's going to be Faraga armor, but x is going to be able to dash away, he's in Shin wants this kill on x -Boy. They got away. Look at the Uranus going for the backline, and Farce is gonna end up dying. Another kill coming in from Ethan Shin. Alice is also gonna die, and that's gonna be another burst for Gosu Hoon. Triple kill coming in for Gosu Hoon. Finally, Gosu coming in for the Gosu members to respawn. If they wait for this, man, Gosu is just gonna keep snowballing. But let's see what happens here. Who's gonna secure this? It's still a 50 50. Lord has been slain by Kari, and that's gonna be it. Will they get cleaned up though? That's gonna be a Selena kill right there on the high load. And Barrett's also killing the Kari. This is not looking good for Brotherhood. Even though they got the Lord, all, a bunch of their members are dying, even if they got the Lord. Immortality still up for this x -Bot, but it looks like he's also gonna die. Wow, very well played from the Ghost Team members, realizing that Brotherhood is very low after doing that Lord. They took advantage of that fact, and they went aggressive and killed the members of Brotherhood. Even if they get Lord, it doesn't matter. They want to end the game right now. Farsa clearing the wave with OT. It doesn't matter. GG well played. That's going to be a dub for Gosu. He's level 4. Sicilian is only level 2, so he needs to play very passive for Sicilian. Oh no, this is not good for Khalid. But look at the counter gank for Gosu first, but coming in from Roger. But it might be a 1 for 1 trade. Gushan finally getting a kill on Kufra, but Joyhead is going to live with 10% HP. Look at the Roger chasing that far subvert form all the way into the second tier tower. But it is not enough food. The, um, nobody does it. It looks like Lucian looking for another gank here at top lane. Um, the problem here, guys, is Esmeralda is very, very hard to go. But look at the Lucian with a burst. Ulti for Esmeralda trying to run away, but too much. Too much fast hands for the Gushin right there. Cooper getting a two-man stun knockoff. Oh my god, very nice up from Cooper. That's gonna be a tall shutdown coming in from Roger. Gushin is finally dead. And look at this. Really like they could they have enough pressure to secure this Lord. 
Let's see who gets it and secures it. They also have the bombing. Who secured the Lord? Can they seal it? Gosu is really, really low. Who got who got the Lord? Lord has been slain by Gosu. And that's gonna be a kill for Cecilian on the Baxia. Actually doing this Lord. Jawhead gets a kill on this Farsa right there. So, but this bombing actually securing the Lord for Gosu. Oh, they still wanna fight after the- Oh, look at the Kufa! Three-man stun! Jesus! And that might be a game-changing play right there. Kufa has been carrying this team. Plays after plays. Wow. If if Brotherhood wants to keep, you know, wants to keep their team alive and secure both sides, both sides of the map, that would have been better. All right, but we see right here, Gushin actually getting picked off here. Oh, Winter Chunchan, and they might get baited. Roger might get baited here by this Farsa. But look at this, he lives with 10% HP. He's still trying to go for a kill. Farsa finally killing that Roger. Look at Boon with the outplay. Boon going in though, he's 10% HP. He's gonna get killed by Jive. Maybe a little bit too greedy here. Jive go for the kill. Farsa, nice play. Nice flicker. Oh, nice flicker from Jive to kill that Farsa. He's still over this. Hikaru triple kill from Jive. He's making a blaze. Jive is doing it. I would be zoning instead of helping right now. And look what happens here. Gosu wants to go in. Who's gonna take this Lord? The Lord has been taken by Roger! But double kill coming in from Tom and it doesn't matter if they took the Lord because they're all dead. Jawhead needs to flicker away. Farsa's is chasing the Sicilian. Sicilian's gonna be able to run away though. Esmeralda was clearing. What will Brotherhood do here? Why is Brother... Okay, oh, never mind. Okay, they're gonna go with the Lord. It is a 33 minute Lord. So this is gonna be a really hard Lord to kill. Look at the Sicilian! Thank you, Sicilian getting a kill speed! This is it, Brotherhood! They're throwing it! Gosu getting pushed into the edge. Roger dies though, but this is not looking good for Gosu. They're dropping off like flies one by one. And Brotherhood with the comeback, maybe. Are they being too greedy? What's going on? One HP Nexus. Oh my god. Link is just giving vision for this squad to comfortably farm around the map. Kari being overextended, he's definitely out of position. He's gonna be a first blood. Again, this is the same mistake that they're doing last time. Bauman is gonna get a kill though. That's gonna be a one for one trade so far. And that is gonna be a two for one trade in favor of Gosu right now. And three, three for one trade in favor of Gosu. It feels like they're capturing both sides of the map instead of just focusing on one side. And look at this, Baxia looking really squishy. A Baxia that looks like Cooper. Oh my God, gets bursted right away by Luna. And the Lord is pushing in this mid lane. I think Gosu wants to end it. They're like, we just gave you guys a chance from last, last game. We're gonna show you guys who is superior and it is looking like Gosu. This is a one-sided match definitely for Gosu right now. All in the towers are gonna go down. They wanna end the game and that is- Ah, uh, yeah, so my blo my brain was slowing down. That was my bad. <laughs> no, cause the, 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 the reason why we picked Gushin was like, we won the first game and then we were so hyped and like, G? G? And I was like, hey, G? <laughs> yeah, like, uh, let's go let's go <laughs> yeah yeah i'm not picking that shit again i'm not picking that shit i mean that's yeah. anything you want to say to your fans to the viewers on the stream <laughs> 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 gg's gg's and thank you to pika for inviting me to cast this tournament for making me lose his vote lose my voice this whole <laughs> my bad my bad <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. I'm just